I'm going to new project uh, with the AI using a Zoom recording and the Google documents. First, 10 phone color, phone color, phone color, plus in the world. I'll ask you this and then both uh, Genghis Khan and Alexander the Great uh, will on the lane and at least uh, yeah, ten conquerors. Alexander the Great, Genghis Khan, yes, I <clears throat> knew it about this. Um, okay, this uh, number one and number two. I need only number one and number two. Uh, here, uh, okay, I copy all of this. Actually, my project is uh, about My project is about <clears throat> uh, Alexander the Great and compare Alexander the Great and Genghis Khan. Just I think I, my, my idea is similar about making the hero, heroes in the world. So, and then with this question, and I got uh, some project here. And then I got 10 person, the conquerors, but I'm um, here without no need to write it about. And then I, I can ask um, similarity uh, between uh, Alexander the Great and Alexander the Great and uh, Genghis Khan. Uh, they uh, write verses about thousand, almost thousand five hundred, thousand five hundred. So, and then Alexander the Great is uh, the, uh, many years ago, yeah, and then, but Genghis Khan is uh, about only 1,000 years ago person. The question here, similarity between uh, Alexander the Great and Genghis Khan. So my project with the, uh, um, here, comparing two conquerors between Alexander the Great and uh, Genghis Khan with the AI. What a AI say about them, and maybe um, already I think uh, uh, these kinds of books or uh, articles, the many things, um, yeah. And then already, and then he report about uh, some uh, some point. I'll go there, and then I can get the unique, unique. Yeah, yeah. He give you he give you some project about my interest, Alexander the Great, and in this time. <laughs> Now uh, I have this. Yeah. Let's read about this. Uh, uh, Alexander Great and Genghis Khan are two of the history's most renowned conquerors, each creating vast empire, leaving lasting legacies despite the different era and the region in which 
believe they share several similarity, uh, military genius innovative tactics. Alexander the Great, non-police brilliant tactic, and battlefield innovation, such as the use of the Harang formation combined with the cavalry charge. Inggis Khan renowned for his innovative military strategies, including the use of the psychological warfare, lapsed mobility, and effective communication across his forces. Creation of vast empire. Alexander the Great, his empire stretched from Greece to Egypt and into Northwest India, covering a vast array of culture and terrains. Inggis Khan established the largest continuous empire in history, spanning from the Pacific Ocean to Eastern Europe and then encompassing the diverse range of culture and people, cultural impact and legacy. Alexander Great is conquest spread Greek culture and Hellenism, Sikh influence across the known world, and blending it with local custom and tradition. Inggis Khan promoted trade and cultural exchange across the Sikh world, contributing to the exchange of ideas, technologies, and goods between East and West. Integration of uh, conquered peoples. Alexander the Great encouraged marriage between the soldier and the local woman and adopted the elements of the Persian dress and the custom to integrate, consolidate his empire. Inggis Khan incorporated conquered people into his army and administration often to employing uh, a talented individual, like the rest of their ethnic or cultural background. Posthumous division of empires. Alexander the Great, his empire was divided among its generals, the uh, Adoch, after his death, and leading to the establishment of several Hellenic kingdoms. Genghis Khan, his empire was divided among his sons and grandsons, leading to the formation of the various uh, planets and the uh, eventual fragmentation of the Mongol Empire, personal leadership and charisma, Alexander Great, not for leading his troops personally into battle and inspiring loyalty and bravery among his men. In his camp, despite exceptional leadership skills, owning the unworld wavering loyalty of his followers through his charisma and strategic acumen, strategy use of the fear of diplomacy, Alexander Great used power both diplomacy and the fear to secure alliance and subdue the potential revolt and ensure it the establishment of his fire. In his time, master the use of the fear of the intimidated enemy, but also employed the diplomacy to secure trade routes and the political alliance. Despite the different context of their conquest, both Alexander the Great and King Spans demonstrate remarkable leadership, strategic brilliance, and the ability to create and manage best cultural diversity empires. So their legacy continues to do influence the historical and cultural relative to this day. Okay, so good we'll report uh, about the similarity of Alexander the Great and the Genghis Khan. My project is uh, about Alexander the Great and the Genghis Khan as your two conquerors, the uh, world known uh, best conquerors, to the number one, number two. And uh, who is uh, better? I don't know. Anyway, so that my interest is about this project, about their young age. So, and then I say about that. Young, young days for uh, young days for Alexander the Great and and Genghis Khan a uh, little bit in detail young days uh, for Alexander the Great and Genghis Khan fashion what the chat to say about this topic my interest is about because uh, Two heroes, two conquerors, a little bit uh, different. And this is divided by, and then um, I can ask about uh, uh, much more detail. Same as similarity, 
between two conquerors in the young days again new new prompt here when i ask you about the similarity it uh ChatGPT give a, a same a same category and then compare uh two heroes uh, alexander the great and Zhang Khan. and uh, I check out Rusty here then. Um, yeah. Mm. My question and um, learning about this history uh, also is uh, very, very interesting. And we do uh, for fun. And then um, there you go. I can read it about their young days eh? and Genghis Khan and Alexander the Great, early life in education. Boston family born in 356 BC in Pella, the ancient capital of Macedonia. Alexander was the son of the King Philip. Second, and the Queen Olympias. His mother claimed descent from Achilles, while his father was a powerful and ambitious ruler. Tutor and education. From a young age, Alexander was educated by some of the best tutors available, notably Aristotle. The great philosopher was his personal tutor from age 13 to 16. As taught to instilled in him so alert for learning science, medicine, and philosophy. Character and skills. Alexander showed early signs of brilliance and ambition. He was known for his intelligence, charisma, and leadership abilities. Even as a young youth, his education under Aristotle also provided him with a broad and then a deep understanding of the various subjects, which later influenced his approach to governance and culture. Early military exposure. Alexander was exposed to military campaigns and leadership. From a young age, at, a, at the age of 18, he played a crucial role in the Battle of Caronia, um, where he commanded the left wing of his father's army and uh, demonstrated his tactical uh, roles. Influence and ambitions, father's influence. In Caliph second military innovation and success laid the groundwork for Alexander's Future contest, Philip's unification of Macedonia, the establishment of a strong professional army was critical element that Alexander inherited. Mythological imperialism, Alexander was deeply influenced by Homeric legend, particularly the epic about Achilles and the hero of the Trojan War. He aspired to emulate their legendary feats. King Khan, early life and struggles. Birth, 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 birth family, born around 100, uh, 1162 and 1162 near the Onon River in present-day Mongolia. Genghis Khan, originally named Temuchin, was the son of the tribal chieftain named Yeske. His whole life was marked by hardship following his father's assassination, a rival Tatar when the Temujin was about nine years old. Through captivity and escape. After his father's death, the Temujin family was abandoned by his tribe and left to defend themselves. And during his teenage years, Temujin was captured by a rival tribe but managed to escape, demonstrating his resilience and the determination of early on. Rise to power. Alliance and the betrayers. Temujin's early life was fraught. Um, with his challenge, including forming alliance and dealing with his betrayers, he forged a close bond with Jamuka, a childhood friend and a brother brother, but their relation eventually turned into a rivalry, marriage and support. Temujin married the Borsa, who became his most trusted confidant, confidant but with, with her, with her support. And uh, through strategic alliance, he began to consolidate power among the Mongol tribes. We risk to kill. From a young age, Temujin displayed extraordinarily little skills. 
He was known for his ability to inspire loyalty, strategic thinking, and his relentless pursuit of his goals, ambition, and vision. Unification of Mongol tribe. Temujin's primary ambition was to unify the um, fractious of the Mongol tribe. He sought to in the, the constant inviting and create a strong cohesive nation. Through a combination of democracy, diplomacy, military strategy, and sea of force of will, he succeeded in uniting and the tribes under the, his leadership. Transformation into Genghis Khan in 12 or Six after successfully unifying the Mongol tribe, Temujin was proclaimed the Genghis Khan, meaning universal ruler. This marked the beginning of the ex expansive conquest and the establishment of the Mongol Empire. Summary: Both Alexander the Great and uh, Genghis Khan exhibited extraordinary leadership quali qualities and uh, strategic brains from a young age. Alexander benefited from a rich education and a stable kingdom that his father had fortified, while Genghis Khan. Uh, overcame significant adversity and uh, hardship, demonstrating resilience and uh, tenacity. Their early experience and uh, ambition set the uh, stage for their later achievement are uh, uh, two of which stories greatest conquerors. Similarity to conquerors in the young ages, Alexander the Great Genghis Khan. Early exposed to leadership, both Alexander Genghis Khan was exposed to leadership roles and military campaigns from a young age. Alexander, he accompanied his part of King Pelican the second of Macedonia on military campaigns and was given common troops at the Battle of uh, Keronia, where he was only 18 years old. Genghis Khan, following his father's death, Genghis Khan stand on as Temujin had to take own leadership responsibility to protect the provide for his family. He demonstrated leadership quality during his teenage years, years particularly in escaping captivity, the forming alliance, struggling and struggles and uh, adversity, both faced significant hardship and challenging during their youth, which shaped their character and prepared them for future conquest, Alexander the Great. Although born into loyalty, Alexander faced political injury and challenges to his succession, including the assassination of his father, King Philip II. These struggles likely instilled in him a sense of determination and resilience. In his Khan, Temujin experienced extreme poverty and uh, was captured by a rival tribe during his adolescence, his father's death, and subsequent abdomination by his tribe, upon forcing him to navigate a harsh, unforgiving environment, fostering his resolve, hope, and survival instinct. From the formation of alliance, and both uh, Alexander and Genghis Khan recognized the importance of forming alliance and the building relations with other leaders and tribes. Alexander the Great, he formed alliance with the neighboring Greek city state and uh, secured the loyal, his general and soldiers through the personal relations and then shared a mission. Genghis Khan's Temujin formed alliance with other Mongol tribes, including his blood brother Jamukha, who consolidated power and united the Mongolian steps under his. Uh, Leadership, quest for unification and fire. Most uh, had ambitious goals of unifying and disparate people say it's very best. I think the great he sought to unify the Greek cities, state, and then expand his empire, the campus territories from Greece to India, branding culture and the rest. This is not about young days. Things come. Temujin's vision was uh, unified the Mongol tribes, then from neighboring regions to create the largest constitution empire in history, the Mongol Empire, which stretched from the Eastern Europe to its, its own also. While their path to greatness dripped in many ways, I like the great Genghis Khan share the common themes of leadership, resilience, ambition, and the push of the United conquest during their formative years. Formative years. These shared experiences likely contribute to their eventual success as conquerors and empire builders. The report is not post stab is okay for the young days, but I mentioned about young days. But the, the end is uh, not a young days, but uh, grown up. It, okay. So and then, this is unique. I um, My project is uh, the first to begin. And then and maybe if i more interested in the uh, Alexander the Great and Genghis Khan's two conquerors, uh, commonly what they did in detail, I can check out more in detail, step by step by using prompt engineering. And this project will detail, I learn about two conquerors more detail with AI.
and very unique project. Uh, yes. 